Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Uh, today we are going to do taking off drainage wax. This is a video that you have asked for and we have prepared it for you and today we will learn how do we take off drainage wax. Uh, if you are new to this channel, this is a channel where we help students revise for their exams in the easiest way possible, especially on concepts that they did not capture very well in their classes. So, uh, in any, if anything is hard for you, maybe it bypassed you in class, or you're doing online learning in quantity survey, or even you're doing part-time classes, you're just studying for yourself, you go and do your exams, this is the right place to be. We are here to help all the students as they revise. We are here to give them the quantity surveying concepts in the easiest way possible. If there's a assignment which is so hard for you, uh, share it to us. We are here to help you. And I'm very glad to announce to you our memberships. Uh, we have membership packs for you. Uh, the first uh, pack is the content supporters. If you like our content and you want to support it, uh, you, we would want to invite you. Uh, we shall be able to do better content for you if you support our content. Uh, you, you know very well that our content requires a lot of time to prepare for you. Uh, we do a lot of calculations, we do uh, some presentations for you and we present them. So it's quite hectic and we because we want to continue producing more videos at a faster rate. Uh, that's why we require your support. Uh, in exchange for your support, we will be able to gift you with uh, notes for five presentations every month if you take our list package. Uh, we have two packages. I'm talking about the content supporters package. If you're able to join this content supporters uh, membership, we shall be able to share with you five uh, presentations of your choice every month. And also, uh, if you're able to join, you'll be able to join our members only chat rooms. Thereby, we listen to students. Uh, students are able to meet and they are able to ask each other questions, uh, challenging questions, and we always come in whenever we you require us to uh, to attend to your questions. And also, we have another membership package, which is called the Exclusive Members Package. This package is uh, specifically for those students who want to, uh, to for us to train them on these uh, quantities of thing, things, especially on takeoffs. Uh, if you want our classes, our classes are all on, in all weekdays, uh, we give assignments to our students, uh, which you do them before the class. Then during the class, we discuss the questions that our members have asked. We also get early access to the videos after our classes. We are able to record our classes and you're able to get early access to our videos, which we share with you. Also, uh, you're able to participate in members only polls to choose upcoming content, uh, the content that we shall be bringing to you. Those who are choosing it are the members uh, only. So, uh, and also if you're in the exclusive member package, you're also uh, able to benefit from the first uh, package, which is you're able to get the notes of five presentations of your choice every month and also you're able to join our members on the chat rooms. Thank you so much. You have been asking how to, you shall be able to get our presentations and also our drawings. Now, here is the, uh, here is the opportunity for you. So we, we are grateful for those who have joined. Uh, we have a few members who have already joined. They asked for it and we are we have already started so uh, keep studying for your exams keep learning from us we are here to assist you so that you can be able to sharpen your skills to the best of our knowledge and our uh, the much we can help you so we shall begin today's video and today's video uh, it entails the taking off drainage wax uh in taking off drainage wax um you shall be able to be given a plan and a section just as all other drinks for taking off so uh, this one is our this one is our plan mm -hmm. then this one is our section 
And our plan, we can see GT1 here, GT2, and WC. These are the sources of our waste. Remember, it's the drainage that we are doing. So it's waste that we are disposing. So from GT1, the waste will come to the manhole, GT2 to manhole 1, and WC to manhole 1. Uh, we, if you study the diagram, you can see that from GT1 to manhole 1, we have 6, millim 6 meters center to center. That means that uh, the pipe that it is that is coming from GT1, GT1 is the collection point for uh, waste here, and GT2 the collection point. Then this here we have the WC. From the WC, it's going direct to the manhole. If you see 6 meters center to center, it means the size of the pipe from inside GT1 to inside a manhole one is six meters then the type of the pipe is a hundred millimeters diameter pvc pipe gt2 gt2 uh, from gt2 to manhole one we have 10 millimeters center to center so uh, from the end of the pipe in gt2 and in the end of the pipe in manhole one the distance is 10 millimeters then uh, it's a hundred millimeters diameter pvc pipe uh, from the WC to manhole 1, it is 8 meters center to center, and it's the type of the pipe is 100 millimeters uh, diameter PVC pipe. From manhole 1, we shall bring the waste to manhole 2. The distance between the two manholes, the ends of the pipe, is 30 millimeters center to center, 30 meters center to center, and it is the 150 millimeters diameter PVC pipe. Uh, from manhole 2, to manhole 3, the, di the distance is 35 meters center to center, and the type of the pipe is 150 diameter millimeter, 150 meters millimeters. Sorry, the diameter of the pipe is 150 millimeters diameter PVC pipe. Then from manhole 3 to the public sewer, we can see that from manhole 3 to the tarmac road is 6 meters center to center. So from the end of the pipe, which is in manhole 3, up to the tarmac road is 6 meters. Then the width of the tarmac road is 8 meters. Then it crosses over up to get to the public sewer, it's 10 meters. Okay, we shall go to study the manhole schedule. The manhole schedule, we have the manhole number. So we have three manholes here. The internal sizes, which is the first manhole is 650. by 900 uh, manhole 2 is 800 by 1000 and manhole 3 is 800 by 1200 uh, ground level uh, for manhole 1 is 96.5 and invert level for manhole 1 is 95.80 so i'll pause it there and ask do you know what is invert level invert level is the uh the the level at the bottom of the inside of the drainage pipe so if this is the drainage pipe that is draining from manhole one this bottom the inside bottom of this pipe the level it has it is the invert level so it's that level that the waste will be taken from uh, that manhole because it's inside the pipe uh, below here the level so manhole 2 uh, the ground level is 96.5 the invert level is 95 manhole 3 the in the ground level is 96.5 and the invert level is 93.9 uh, public C where the ground level is 96.5 and the invert level is 93.30 if we study the section here I know you cannot be able to see these writings very clearly I got them from an, uh, an old book so I'll read them for you. Then maybe I'll make a drawing that is clear. Uh, for those who will be getting the notes, you'll get a clear drawing for this one, as in clear writings uh, for this section. So uh, here up, we have the medium duty GI cover, uh, mid frame size 600 by 450 millimeters. Then we had the 100 millimeters thick uh, slab reinforced with a mess bus, uh, 100 millimeters center to center, both ways. Then here we have the 12 millimeters thick uh, 
waterproof rendering you know the plaster eh? it's waterproof then here we have the 150 millimeters thick solid concrete block wall uh-huh then we have the 12 millimeters diameter ms tape um but ms tapes at 300 millimeters center to center so the distance between one step to the other is 300 millimeters okay then here we have the 150 millimeters uh concrete ratio one is to three is to six benching this concrete that you see here it's called benching uh it's raised in level and then it is slopes so that all the waste can drain into the into the pipe then here we have the concrete ratio one is to three is to six uh bend this concrete its thickness is a hundred but this uh spread here the spread is 150 so it's a typical section through manhole i hope we have been able to go the drinks and you have understood you need to understand the drawing before any takeoff so that you can be able to know exactly what you're taking off all right so we will go direct to the taking off